Ben, please don't. I'm sorry, Alex. No! Goodbye! What do you want? Hoped. Oswald's estate would be liquidated to further fund the good work we do here at Sunnyside. Close the door, Alice. We discussed the matter in some detail. And your great uncle assured me that we would be included in the will. Is there some kind of problem? Problem? No. Not at all. Apart from the five bloody years we had to look after the potty old shit. Are you sure he's dead, by the way? Have you prodded him? Because I wouldn't be surprised if he marched in here right now and tried to copulate with my desk. Hmm. He's done it before, you know. 104 years old. And the bastard wouldn't keep still. And to find out that we're getting nothing. There's the will. Oh, and the escape reports. We won't be needing them. Escape reports? Mr. Croucher, your great uncle tried to escape from Sunnyside no less than two hundred times. Two hundred times! Sorry I was late, by the way. What did I miss? The funeral. You missed the funeral. So, where are you living these days? In a tent just down the road? Do you work? What about food? There's an apple tree next to the tent. You know, I could... No, thanks. You don't even know what I was going to say. You were going to offer me a job, selling shitty moulded pieces of plastic to kids. I'm still amazed you haven't been sued. Transformers. They're called Transformers, with two Zs. It's completely different. What does the will say? Redecorate, throw all this crap out. Not everything. I can't believe he gave you this place. He gave you a house too? Oh, the Dobbin. Remember? That thing was gay when we were kids. Now it's just fucking tragic. You used to love coming here. What changed? I developed something called taste. Right, we've seen the place now. Can I get going? We haven't seen my place yet. I never imagined he'd leave me a house. Juniper Lane, Blagden. Blagden's only five minutes away. I've got to get back to work. I've got a lot to catch up on. I'm very busy. Fine. Forget it then. I'll walk. All right. 
right, I'll give you a lift. But make it quick. Can I get out of this suit first? Look like you. Your place is a shithole. Ben. Ben. I never wanted the cottage. But why do you get it? What kind of life lesson is that? Abandon your only family and act like a twat. And here you go, have a house. But look after your loved ones and what do you get? You get a shed. I am not a twat. Yes, Alex. Yes, you are a twat. You're very much of a twat persuasion. You never went see Oswald at the home. You never took him sweet. You never even liked him. I liked him. He was fucking insane. And I liked him. And I thought he was brilliant. I like him a hell of a lot more now. He's given me a house. Ugh! Ugh! Do you want to live back to your tent? No, I'm sticking it out here. How are you going to survive? I think I saw a cherry tree back there. Those of you who know me know my pedigree. Those that don't let my products speak for themselves. Transformers, Power Strangers, Potato Baby, plus others. Original toys for a discerning generation who know the right shit to play with. But gentlemen, it's time to up our game. Let me introduce to you my greatest creation yet. Roll dog. Sexy dolls with attitudes and dolls of their own that you need to buy phones, clothes and makeup for. Otherwise, all your friends will hate. Alex, you're here. Your phone's been off. Are you okay? I've been worried about you. I'm fine. I was just prepping for the presentation. The presentation's off now for another two weeks. What? What happened? You said your uncle died. Oh, that. Are you sure you're okay? You said he was your only relative. I'm distraught. I think I might need some grief sex. Groucho, I'm your boss. I'm not having sex with you. Again? You forgot to add again. I was drunk and you are a twat. I'm not a twat. No, wait. Come back. What am I supposed to do now? Oh, I don't know. Go and meet up with your friends or go for a drink. Just don't bother me. And no, drunken texts. Hello? 
Uh, yes, I'd like to report a missing person, please. About ten days. At his house. Well, it's more of a shed, actually. Has he done this before? Um, no. Well, well wait. Um, yes, he did, yes. How long for? Oh, about four years. It's both very late and very early. What the fuck? Alex? Ben? Where have you been? I've been... inconvenienced. I see you've decorated. Alex! Is that the food? Come on then. What's going on? Where have you been? In there. What's in there? This isn't about me getting Oswalds, is it? You're not about to have me killed, are you? wasn't supposed to be found. Not by humans, anyway. But Oswald found it. I think that's why he kept trying to escape. There's no reception. Of course not. No satellites. We're not on Earth? How do you feel, honestly? I think... I think I feel... good. I feel really good. Wait, this isn't right. I don't think I should stay. No, don't go yet. What do you want to do? Be honest. I want to go for a run. not something that makes any sense on our planet, but here as you run, you learn. And as you learn, you navigate through the levels of the world. After a while you can start to manipulate things. You start to know more about what it is and why it's here. It's a training ground for the gods. And Oswald found it. Not originally, no. It was found over a hundred years ago by a woman. She. I don't even know her real name. How do you know all this? I just do. And so will you if you run for long enough. She shaped this landscape. It didn't always look like this. There have been no gods here in a long time. It was chaos. The woods, the fields, the beach. It's all her. Finally, she took the ultimate step. She cut her link to the door so she can never return. Imagine an invisible cord looped around your ankle. Wherever you go when you're here, you carry your door with you. If you want to leave, just walk back a little, think of where you want to be, and it'll take you back. So if I wanted to go back to my flat, that's where you'll go. One door, many exits. But be aware, 
it needs to be somewhere you've been before and you can't be in two minds about where you want to be otherwise the door might end up sending you back to three different places at the same time here in Runland Runland that's what I call it here in Runland you're slowly being infected by the power it gives you dimension jumping shifting reality all that stuff leaves an imprint you saw what I was like back at the shed when you get back home you're going to feel drunk and hungry you'll be a bit crazy too is that why Oswald went crazy? because he spent all his time here no, he went mad because he couldn't come back why did he ever leave then? Oh my god! Cowboy Spaceman! What? This is when I first realised I wanted to make toys. See? I took the body of a spaceman and the hat of a cowboy and I made Cowboy Spaceman. <laughs> That's fucking brilliant. I can't believe he kept it. What time is it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Hang on. Yeah, it's working now. It's 11 in the morning. That's not too bad. On Thursday. When did we go into Runland? Sunday morning. I think I missed another presentation. Is that bad? Very. But for some reason, I don't care. Plus, I have a gymungous craving for jam. Whoa! It's doing it again. What's that? What's that noise mean? I think someone's calling me. She's angry. She says I have to go into the office right now. Are you going? Nah. How can I make her happy? You can make her a really good toy. Cowboy Spaceman! Hey. What shall I do, Cowboy Spaceman? Shall I get Claire a present? You should bake her a cake, Alex. She'd like you then. A cake? That's a really good idea. You'll need special ingredients. Where are you going to get the special ingredients from? I know where. How do you know? I just do. This cake's going to be magic. Yeah! Hello. I told you to come into the office. Well, you're in trouble. I finally managed to get Hardwee's back in the office again today. He came in with the rest of the board on Monday when you did your silly little disappearing act. Glass of wine. I can't. I'm driving. Why do you look different? Are you sure you don't want a glass of wine? Fuck no, Alex. I've been standing up for you and I've been standing up for this project. But look at you. Is this all just a joke? No, I promise. No. It's not a joke. It's just a toy. It's my career! Mess your own life up all you want, but don't bring me down with you! I've been told to give you one last chance. This Monday you do the Lodor's presentation, or you're fired. Wait, no. What's that? It's a cake. Oh. Do you want some? No, I can't. I've got to... Just one slice. It'll make you happy, I promise.
Claire, I... Don't bother, I'll see you on Monday for the presentation. You'd better be ready. Uh, wait, wait, Claire, don't go. Nothing? Ah, uh, what is it? Nothing. I'm uh, starting to wonder if it isn't a bit unsafe. Unsafe. I guess I'm just asking you not to go back in for a while. You know, give it a rest for a bit. I've thought this through. You can stay at Oswald's. I'll, I'll give you money. I don't want your fucking money. Christ, you always used to do this. Do what? Confuse your wants with mine. Like when we were kids, you could never understand that my favourite thing to do was sleep. Yeah, I remember. It's demented. You can't sleep all your life. Why not? If it's what you like doing, why the fuck not? Alex, I want this. Runland is exactly what I want. I want to run every day. I want to feel alive. Look, there's something I haven't told you. Just oh, listen to me, please. Spend the weekend at Oswald's and see how you feel. I'll stay with you. We'll get a few beers, make a weekend of it. See, this is fun. I'm near pissing myself with excitement. When are you going back? Tomorrow night. I've got the presentation Monday. If I mess up again, Claire will kill me. She seems nice. I like her. What was that knife for? I can't tell you. You don't even worry. I'm worried now. Promise me you won't do anything stupid.
He told me he did, but I never thought. What are you talking about? So why did you hate Oswald so much? I didn't hate him. He was just a stupid old man. You thought he abandoned us. He was. When mum and dad died, you wanted to come and live here. I know you did, because I did too. But you thought Oswald abandoned us. When we first went to live with Brian and Mary, I planned to run away and leave me behind. I would have come back for you. I was just thinking if I could just make it to Oswald's, he'd sort everything out, you know, make everything okay. I knew there must be some kind of mistake. We were supposed to come and live here. Didn't you always think that? Of course. I thought he didn't want us. It was really early in the morning. I got my savings and I crept out of the house. And it was then that I realised I didn't even know how to get back here. I didn't even know what village. I was only ten. I didn't know what to do. I didn't have a plan. Oswald told me he fought for us, but they turned him down. They told him he was too old. They wouldn't tell him where we were, so he couldn't even contact us. I mean, he was massively old. But of course, Runlander kept him young. I tried to tell you about him, that he didn't give up on us, that he saved our Christmas presents every year up until he went into the home. But you never wanted to know. I even wrote you a letter once explaining everything. Why did you send it to me? Didn't have the money for a stamp. Look in that green box. Open it then. Oswald stayed out of Runland for us. I think he hoped we'd return one day. Any minute.
Ben, please don't. I'm sorry, Alex. No! Goodbye! I'm just going to sit here all day and get drunk. I was planning on pissing myself in a minute. Oh, lovely. I'm fired, aren't I? There are so many different types of fired. Thought so. They've kept me on, though. You okay? No. But I can't tell if it's just because I pissed my life away. Or if it's because I want to go for a run. Or if it's because I miss my brother. I didn't know you had a brother. I didn't. And then I did. No, I don't again. Well, no, no, not my booze. Look, you don't need it. It's rotting your brain. And besides, you're cooking me dinner tonight, and I don't want you setting yourself on fire. I'm not your boss anymore. It doesn't feel any different. Well, it isn't much. You're still a twat. Anyway, see you at eight. Do you ever worry? that there's not enough downloadable content for your Dolls Dolls MP3 player. Look. It's Cowboy Spaceman. Yeah. 